Are we on? Oh, 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 okay, okay. We have the responsibility of policing the entire festival. And obviously, uh, your conduct is such that it's causing a disturbance, and it's a direct threat to the safety of everyone here. Someone could get hurt. You, you already have blood on your face. One of the festival people, one of my officers, anybody can get hurt. So we're going to start you on when they start throwing things and become a little bit more aggressive than what you see. Okay, I understand that. And I don't I don't disagree with you. But part of the reason that they throw things on stuff is because you tell them stuff, you know, you tell them stuff that en enrages them. In fact, we don't even we're not even preaching. So it's obviously the signs. Now now the signs are gonna be illegal. I mean we're not even talking. My thing is if you just have a couple of officers there that would kind of keep them at bay. Okay, but then I would have to have a couple of officers in each group that decides to come here to protest. Uh, we're not protesters. Okay, not well, pro if we were protesters, we'd have a tent like Occupy. Okay, well, I, I don't know what the significance of the figure is. What's the pitch? Uh, well, unfortunately, they're kind of uh, petrified of, of that animal. And because, uh, because the officers weren't around us, the, the pig head was kind of in lieu of, of the sheriff's department. Okay, That's so kind you, of kept so, him at bay. So, so you brought a pig head to, to threaten them? No, to, to calm them down a little bit. I, That's don't think, I don't think it calmed them down. Oh, it did. It did. It all worked. Right, well, tell you what, we're going to escort you. We'll get you out of here safely. Well, uh, if, we, if we walk out, it's only going to happen after we've walked the route. You're going to leave now. We're escorting you that way. It's, it, we, we can't do that. Yeah, we're, it's, we're, it's, you're going to. We're going to. You're, you're going all that uh, way. You know, it, it, it's, it's not yeah. your call. We've been very gentle and very, very respectful to you. You are jeopardizing public safety. And you need to understand it's going overboard. We don't have the coverage. Okay? If we protect you and we have two officers that can protect you, it'll work great. It's impossible to do so. You're attracting a crowd and you're affecting public safety and you need to understand that so so the signs are affecting Take public safety there. Now, well apparently what you are saying to them and they are saying back to you is creating danger they, how, how many how many bottles or objects have you been hit with <laughs> uh, I, I lost count and it's okay. only it's okay. only because you guys weren't around okay, we have video of that we don't have enough people to be with everybody at the festival and we're not I can't, I can't assign a couple officers to each group well, what you need to bring your people out and we're going to leave what happens is when they apply for a permit they should have realized this would happen who, when, who applied for it? Well, when the city of Dearborn allows a permit, uh, then for the festival? Absolutely. Okay, Absolutely. Well, you know, I, I mean, and, and this is common sense. Uh, we did try to contact the sheriff. Okay. And the problem is he didn't respond. We did try to contact well, the city I, I, be, I believe that the sheriff's office sent you a written response. No, no. no. In fact, uh, 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 my attorney said they did not. And so what, what happened, the reason why this is going on now is because of what happened last year. What happened last year is you allowed it to escalate into this. And so uh, I mean, we, you, we you guys just lost it. a lawsuit on free speech and you want to do it again. Okay. We need to leave. I don't think we're gonna we're gonna go anywhere. Why don't you get us the bullpen that we asked for in the email? Okay, well that's a free speech zone, and the Chamber of Commerce decided that they did not want a free speech zone. You're here to protect our rights. I'm here to protect. Safety. I'm here to protect everybody. everybody. And keep safety. And get us a bullpen. And where were you when the bottles were flying? And, I and was you're grabbing people. Well, no, there there was officers that actually turned the other way. I mean, no, they didn't want to give up. No, well, Come on, we need to go before we get, end up with all what, this. What's the problem? The problem is that one of your people is going to get hurt, or one of the crowds going to get hurt, or one of my officers going to get hurt. You know that this is just going to escalate until it's... Uh, well, if you have a couple of uniforms... Like I don't have a couple about. of uniforms. There's 100,000 <laughs> people who come to this festival, and i got about 25 to 30 officers. But just two officers, if, no, if you no. think it's a threat, so you're going to jeopardize free speech. You you want you want to I'm stop not off. trying to jeopardize free speech. Free speech. That's what you're doing. Keep going, please. No, That's what you're doing. Thank you. I'm not trying to jeopardize free speech. I'm not.
The whole festival is free speech. Let me ask you this. If we don't leave, are we going to get arrested? Probably. I just need to know yes or no. That's probably. like me probably saying yes, we'll let we'll stay or not. No, pro probably we will cite you all. Yes. And if, that's, if, that's, if that's what you want, what? I mean, I don't, I don't understand what good that does. I just need I to know if I'm going to be arrested or not, or if you just thought it was a good idea that we walk away. No, if you're I, telling me that we're going to get arrested, that's what I need to know. Well, are, you, are you telling me that we're going to get arrested? I'm, we... I'm not telling you they're going to be arrested, but you know you are a danger to the public safety. You're disorderly. I would now, I would assume uh, you know uh, 200 angry Muslim children throwing bottles would be more of a threat than a few guys with signs. Huh? All right, hang on a second. He, he's rewarding riotous behavior. Yes. If they make us leave now, they reward riotous behavior. They'll just create a riot, knowing that then the cops will get rid of them if they cause a riot. They're, they're... You're saying we will. If you don't leave, we're going to cite you for disorder. You're creating a disturbance in the festival. So, so you're, I mean, you're, look at your people here. Look at, look at, you know, this is crazy. And let's go. And you would think we'd be complaining, but we're not. Well, we're not the one complaining. We're not the one phoning 911. We we ask you if you were assaulted. And yeah, you're, you're killing one. Uh, you're you're killing a gentleman. Right? Right? You're killing. We're gonna we're gonna, go. we're gonna go ahead and get our vehicle and have you come down the alley. But uh, we gotta. We we're gotta gonna wait. make sure you get there safe. Uh, yeah, let's, let's go. go back here a little bit so we can control this mess. Yeah. So we're, we'd be arrested if we don't leave. Is what you're saying? You decided for disorder. You're you're just rewarding them for riotous behavior.